Hi and welcome to a new video. Have you recently encountered an issue where your app won't launch, crashes frequently, or becomes unresponsive? In this video, I will show you several solutions to solve this problem on your iPhone. Let's go. First off, try to force quit the app and restart it afterwards. In most cases, restarting the application can fix any temporary issues that may have occurred. If the problems appear to be isolated to specific third-party apps, try updating them or check if there is an ongoing update running on the background. To review, open the App Store, go to your account information, and scroll down to the list of your downloaded apps. Be sure to click each Update button if there is any. Most bugs on any app stem from outdated features, therefore it's important to regularly keep them up to date. Also, check if the certain app that keeps glitching is currently undergoing an update. It would explain why the app might be temporarily unavailable. At this point, let the update finish and then try to reopen the app afterwards. Sometimes, even the most recent update can't fix a persistent problem with an application. Therefore, it is most effective to simply delete and reinstall the app on your iPhone. You can also try to force restart your device. This approach is very simple, but it frequently fixes any minor software glitches on your iPhone. For iPhone 8 or newer models, quickly press and release the volume up and volume down buttons respectively. Then press and hold the side button and release it when the Apple logo appears. If you're using an older iPhone model, you can refer at the tag in the top right corner or find the link to the Apple support page in the description below to know how to force restart your device properly. Unfortunately, if all apps, even the pre-installed ones, won't launch, it's possible that an iOS bug causes the issue. In this case, I suggest you use a third-party software instead to resolve any issues on your iPhone. For this, I recommend Tenorshare Reboot, which addresses nearly all software issues on your iPhone. This method is quite practical because it will also immediately update your iPhone to the most recent iOS version in addition to fixing any software glitches. Aside from that, it also works both on Mac and Windows PC. However, please note that most of its features require a paid subscription. If you want to try and test it out, you can download the software by clicking on the tag at the top right corner or find the link in the description below. Upon installation, launch Reboot on your computer and click the Start button. Next, click on Standard Repair. The program will then automatically provide the latest firmware that is compatible with your device. After that, follow the on-screen instructions to complete the repair process. When the repair is finished, your iPhone will automatically reboot and the problem should now be resolved. And that's it! If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye!